first bite, here we go. Wow. Wow. Welcome back. We're gonna do a review on this thing. It's called Real Good Pizza Co. Because apparently, <laughs> Real Good Pizza Co. The company's name is Real Good Pizza Co. And apparently, they're really good at making pizzas, yo. <laughs> that wasn't really that funny. But, anyways, guys, it is an uncured pepperoni flavor with mozzarella cheese and pizza sauce. <laughs> what makes the crust low carb? is it's chicken and Parmesan cheese. It's pretty crazy. If you guys ever been to Taco Bell, I know they got like that whole Taco Bell shell that's made out of chicken breast. That's probably where they got the whole idea of this. Four grams of carbs, 25 grams of protein. And by the way, while I'm talking, look at how cute my daughter is next to the pizza box. Isn't she adorable? We're gonna bake this and right now the oven is going at 425, which is the right pre pre-workout temperature. It's the right preheating temperature so we're gonna do it at 425 for 20 to 23 minutes or until it's done so yeah see you guys in 20 to 23 minutes all right wow it smells just like a regular pizza So that is the pizza. Welcome back, 23 minutes later. And guys, this is what I gotta say about this pizza. If you're to look at it, you can see the moisture that is like, ah oh man, it's, it's, it's super moist. Like, it's weird, I had the oven on, there was a rack under it. So you'd kind of expect the moisture to be evaporated while it's cooking. But anyways, I left it on top of this cooking pan, or this cutting board. And look at all that juice that's on there. All right, so disclaimer, it is made out of chicken and Parmesan cheese as the crust. It's not like a, it's gonna be a crispy crust, which was what I was hoping. This is how it looks like. This is what it smells like. Here, smell. Mmm, sniff, sniff. Um, it smells just like a regular pizza. Wow, it smells just like a regular pizza. But when you get closer to it and you smell it, you do smell the chicken breast. It almost smells like a chicken tender. On t with pepperoni and cheese on top of it, which is basically what it is, you know what I mean? Which is, it's pretty cool, guys. Like, think about it. It's made out of chicken breast rather than the conventional flour and dough that other pizzas are made of. But anyways, guys, it's super keto-friendly. Again, let me go over the recipe or the, the contents, guys. 50 grams of protein just for this. Just for this right here, this is 50 grams of protein. That's like two and a half scoops of protein powder that you generally get. Anyways guys, bon appetit. Here is my first reaction to this pizza. Ooh, this is a nice thumbnail. All right, I was just practicing taking the thumbnail picture. But anyways guys, first bite, here we go. Wow. 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 I can't get over it. That seriously tastes. All right, if you're ketogenic, ketogenic waking, if you're ketogenicing your diet, all right, and you're like, you haven't had any pizza in a while, this is seriously hitting the spot. It's salty, just a little bit of tanginess. Honestly, I would prefer a little bit more of the par Parmesan, the marinara sauce, but I guess I didn't want to make it too saucy considering that it's not like a regular dough. Well, you, the, the cheese is super flavorful, pepperoni is super flavorful. It almost, it, it tastes like a legit pizza. It's just the texture is a little different. It's a little bit more chewy with the fact that the crust is made out of meat rather than actual dough. Um, I did try to crisp it up a little bit more by having the cheese get browned, if you notice over there. Um, mm. I wanna try, I wanna try, I wanna try. So my friend MC is actually with me and I'll let her have a try and let her give her your reaction. Here. A little, like, I just want like a little piece bite. I want to try. What do you think? Eat the pepperoni. 
Hold on a second. Let's see what Crumpy thinks. Yeah, yeah, go, yeah. Let's see what you think. Is it good? The texture is mm -hmm. a little dry. Here, here, have a lick. Here, have a lick, have a lick. Oh, here, lick. Oh, yeah, oh. oh, okay. Taffy, that's enough. That's enough. That's enough. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're literally letting her eat it. Taffy, <laughs> oh, she's gonna. Okay, she's gonna, <laughs> you know what? She's gonna swallow it. That thing. Okay, hold on. Let me just give that to her. Here you go. What do you think? Tell them what do you think. Okay, so the texture is kind of dry. It's a little like, um, mm? okay. Um, wait, can I get a little baby bite? Mm. Yeah, that was too small of a bite, don't you guys think? I'm trying to think. Okay, the sauce is very good. Sauce is very good, it's creamy, it's pretty light on the sauce. Pretty light on the sauce good on the cheese but the texture of the crust is kind of like chicken breast it really is it's like it really is like breaded i don't know it's kind of like breaded chicken breast because the texture is a little bit like dry it's not like bread at all i will give this i will give this honestly for a keto kind of pizza which i've never had before i give this a seven out of ten i would try it again i would buy it myself but i would try other flavors because I'm not much of a pepperoni person that much, honestly. Sorry. But yeah, it's pretty good. I would get it. Right. Oh my god. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> People are gonna be thinking. By the. All right. So yeah, guys, that was my review on this real good pizza company, Pizza. It was really good. What can I say? It's totally the name says it all. But. Again, it's not gonna taste like a regular pizza. Texture-wise, it's not gonna taste the same because the different, the different, the ingredients are different. Duh! It's like drinking water and be like, "Hey, this doesn't taste like soda." It's because it's water. And hey, this pizza dough is not gonna taste like pizza dough because it's chicken. So why did the chicken cross the road to get inside of this pizza? You feel me? All right, cool guys. Um, thanks for watching. This is my daughter tuning in. She's saying hello and goodbye. Isn't she adorable? If you, all right, guys, like this video. <laughs> okay. You all right, cool, cool. All right, guys. Thanks for watching this video. All right. If you guys liked it, if it was entertaining, be sure to like it, and also be sure to subscribe it. Subscribe it. Subscribe to this video, guys, or subscribe to this channel because I'm gonna make more videos on keto foods, and I also do a bunch of other videos like this. Like that. Yeah, it's right here, right? Be sure to check out these other videos because I have a whole new playlist on keto cooking or keto kitchen. I don't know what to name this playlist, but I'm gonna do a lot more foods for you guys. And also check out this channel again or check out this playlist because it's a bunch of random food reviews or restaurant reviews or foodie reviews. Anyways, guys, thanks for tuning in. As always, as always, God bless you. See you guys in the next one. Wait, as always. <laughs> As always, God bless you, and see you guys in the next week. As always, God bless you, and have the best. That's how I do it. As always, God bless you, and have the best day ever.